Kristen Futrell, how are you? I am great, thanks. Thank you for welcoming me to your wonderful neighborhood, Our Elliot. Our pleasure. Our pleasure. Tell me what you think is fabulous about Elliot. This is a, it's a real neighborhood. Mm. I love living in a, a true city neighborhood. Mm -hmm. So you know your neighbors, sometimes they drive you crazy. <laughs> yeah, especially when the warm weather starts up again and now everybody's sitting on their front porches half the night when I'm trying to sleep. But, <laughs> so that can sometimes be the curse, but it's, it's truly the blessing. Truly it the is blessing. truly the blessing At of the end a of the great community. neighborhood. Yes, yes. That's mm -hmm. wonderful. Yeah, it is. If, if there was something you wanted to change about Elliot, what would it be? I would like to change the demographic. I think there aren't enough young people moving ah. into Elliot, and for it to continue to thrive, that's mm -hmm. going to have to change. It's going to have to change. Yes. yes. What, 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 what do you think would close the gap that would make people come, youth, the youth come? I think people have to know it exists. First of all. People don't know that we're up here and you, know, you look over our shoulder here at this fabulous view. Mm. How do people not know this exists? But they don't. They don't. <laughs> I'm guilty. <laughs> I didn't know. I didn't know it existed for most of my life. Well, what's state. the housing market like here? There are always houses for sale in the neighborhood. Mm -hmm. uh, there are several just right down the road right now. Really? So there, this is definitely an area where, uh, where there is growth potential. And okay. we're, we're close to everything. Mm -hmm. You can get into the city in five minutes, into mm -hmm. Oakland in seven minutes. What's not to love? What's not to love? I know. <laughs> I know. Well, what would make, what are the things that you think you could do, city or community group, or that would make people come here? And, and that's a tough one it, because it's, it's a monetary investment at some point that yes. the city will have to make in cleaning up some of these older neighborhoods. Mm -hmm. We've got some abandoned homes uh, that need to be dealt with. We have some problem areas mm -hmm. that need to be dealt with. You know, some of, some of the people in the area need a little bit of hope. Hope. And, and, <laughs> and you, you have to. And, that's, and that lifts up the whole neighborhood and that brings more people in. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. In 25 years, what do you see, Elliot? I hope that this continues to be a very close-knit, very small neighborhood. Okay. Yeah, because we don't want it to become another Mount Washington. Uh, where it's yeah, overpopulated mm. and too much traffic and too many people all the time. So I hope it continues to retain that neighborhood feel. Absolutely. But grows. But continues still grows. To grow. yeah. What kind of businesses would you like to see come to Elliot? A grocery store. Ah. A, uh, some better uh, you know, corner markets, that kind of stuff. Mm -hmm. um, and down in the West End, which is not the other little neighborhood very close by here, they've really done some work in that business district. You know, some more restaurants, mm -hmm. some shopping areas would we'll be very nice. Shops. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. absolutely, yeah. yeah. If, if you were to look at a, another Pittsburgh neighborhood and say you would like to emulate it, what neighborhood would that be and why? That's an interesting question. Um, so maybe a Highland Park? Point Breeze kind of place where you keep that neighborhood feel, but you you have enough investment in the area that the area is growing and is thriving mm -hmm. and is a sought out zip code. Okay, mm -hmm. I I feel you on that. Yes, it's yeah. interesting you say that mm -hmm. because it is. It still has all the qualities. Absolutely. All of both of those neighbors who yes. still have those qualities. Abs yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. And you know your neighbor. Yes. Yeah. yeah. And that's and that's really that's the beauty of this area. You really do know your neighbors. And um, do you have children? I do not. You have two children. I saw. I have that. dogs. Four legs. <laughs> yes, I have two dogs. Uh -huh. So you, you're, uh -huh. you're, you feel safe here? I do. Yeah. Very safe. Yes. And you've got places for the puppies to go. Absolutely. We're can... we're up here at the park all the time and. Some of my neighbors may forget my name at times, but they all know my dog's name. Yeah. And, <laughs> See, I told um, you had kids. Yes. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah, so it's really a fabulous place fabulous up here. Place to it be. is. It really, I love my neighborhood. I feel well, very, very lucky. You really made me interested in looking further and closer yes. at, yes. at Ellie. You really it's, have. Yeah, you well, really good, have. because I, I, think, I think this is a special area, and there's a lot of people here who've lived in this neighborhood for 70 years and they talk about what it used to be like when the trolley ran mm -hmm. right up through here and 
Yeah, I would love to see us get back to something like that. Oh, I'm, I'm so envious of what this place must have been like in the 40s and 50s. <laughs> the 40s and 50s. <laughs> it was a little before my time. Yes, but we do want to do the time machine thing. Yes. We can go back, uh -huh. we can go back yes. to the future. <laughs> yes, yeah, because I, I just, I feel very lucky to have found a home here. I do, yeah. I think somebody else had said, we want to go back to the future, and I can I see where it's yeah. mm -hmm. But, you know, one thing I was impressed about is seeing all the children I know. Uh -huh. Different races. Yes. Yep. Different mm -hmm. sizes. It's just yeah. as happy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And this is this is a very multicultural. Yeah. Very diverse You can feel neighborhood. it. Yeah. Just driving mm -hmm. up. Absolutely. And it's Absolutely. like, in this nice little noogie, I uh -huh. would have never known it was here. I know. Beautiful. Yeah, you, people have no idea it exists. And when I say I live in Elliot, people say, huh? Huh? <laughs> but like, now is that a person? You, now you're going to spread the word. And everyone's going to know. Everyone's uh -huh. going to know. Uh -huh. We're counting on you. Uh -huh. Thank you so My much pleasure. for having us here in your My neighborhood. Pleasure. This was beautiful. Yes. Thank Come you back and that. visit anytime. Thank you. Okay. <laughs>